Understanding Buffer Zone, a simple guide. Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's lesson on understanding the phrase, buffer zone. This term can be quite common in news stories, geography, and even in everyday conversation when discussing conflict or personal space. Today, we'll break down what it means, how to use it, and some examples to help you understand it fully. So, let's get started. The phrase, buffer zone, refers to an area that lies between two or more other areas, often with the purpose of separating them and reducing the risk of conflict. This term can be applied in several contexts, which we will explore. The key idea here is separation and protection. Historically, buffer zones have been used in military strategy and geopolitical terms. Countries have created buffer zones to put space between themselves and potential adversaries. An example is the demilitarized zone between North and South Korea, which serves as a buffer to prevent military escalation. In environmental terms, a buffer zone might refer to an area that protects a nature reserve from nearby areas of development or farming. These zones help preserve biodiversity and protect endangered species by creating a safe space, free from human interference. On a personal level, a buffer zone can describe a comfortable distance between people to ensure privacy or personal space. In social settings, respecting someone's buffer zone means acknowledging and maintaining a distance that feels comfortable for social interaction. Economically, a buffer zone can be a metaphor for a safety margin in finances or resources, ensuring stability even when there are external fluctuations. Similarly, in business regulations, buffer zones can apply to areas with restricted activities to protect public health and safety. I hope this video has helped clarify the concept of a buffer zone for you. Whether it's in the context of world politics or your personal space at a coffee shop, understanding and respecting buffer zones is important. Remember, it's all about creating safety, separation, and protection in various aspects of life. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to practice using this phrase in your conversations. Until next time, keep learning!